Hi everyone, so I'm back and I'm sorry that my lighting is a little weird, it's just that the sun is reflecting um, and I have the shades closed and all. So I'm going to try to move this maybe a little bit closer. Um, I don't know if that's any better or not, but anyhow, I kind of wanted to show you um, my face of the day routine. Um, I tried to upload this video yesterday, however, I was unsuccessful um, because YouTube was having, I guess, some issues, so it wasn't allowing me to go ahead and update it, so I kind of want to update it for you now and show you guys. Um, so don't mind my hair, I kind of just have it put back just so that I can go ahead and do the face of the day. So basically what I start off with is um, this Smart Cover Concealer Cream, and this is in medium beige. Um, I was using before the light beige, and I think that it was a little too light for my color uh, complexion, so it was kind of making me look a little pale. So basically what I do is I just um, grab the little bottle, and I just kind of dab it to where I think it's. I have uh, redness, which is basically my cheeks. I will dab a little bit down my nose. And anywhere where I have might have um, some impurities or some uh, scarring or pimples that I want to cover up. And I kind of just put it on there, I dab it on. I do not use a brush to blend this in. Um, this formula is a, it's pretty thick. So I kind of like um, to use my fingertips simply because the brush will just get pasty. Um, and I apply foundation over this anyhow. Um, before I did this, I primed my face, and I primed my face with this Skin MD Naturals. Um, and I'm get, I have been talking about this. I'm going to be doing a um, a in depth re review about that because I think it's just great um, for your face, and it's all natural um, ingredients. So basically you just smooth it out and under your eye you just want to kind of stretch it so that you don't have any kind of creases or anything. And if you hear that noise, don't mind it, it's just my washing machine. And I've been feeling, I don't know if you guys um have been watching my videos lately, but I've kind of been feeling a little bad, a little sick actually. Um, I have my wisdom teeth that are coming out and it's on this side so it hurts like hell. I'm highly medicated on antibiotics um, and painkillers and all that good stuff. So I felt a little better and I decided to come and do the face of the day for you guys. So basically, I just kind of smear it out until I think that it's evenly um, proportioned on my face. And I don't have any gaps or, or anything like that. And once I have that, um, like uh, you smear it out and all that good stuff, I am ready to apply my foundation. Before I do so, I'm going to take... Um, a wet wipe which I'm using these Maybelline Expert Eyes which I hate I don't like them they irritate my skin my face so I'm just using it to clean off my makeup on my fingers um, I don't like them at all I like the EPL ones and I haven't been able to find them so I'm gonna have to purchase some um, maybe on the weekend at Walmart some of the um, the Equate I know that Mari said it, uh, spoke about it in her video and I've used them before also so um, I'm gonna be taking one of those and purchasing one of those because I also bought this one and they suck as well so yeah not liking them at all um, anyways so now that's done I'm gonna go ahead and take my foundation brush and I'm gonna be using this one from speedymakeupcase.com and I'm just gonna take some of my MAC foundation And I'm going to dip my brush into the bottle because I have um, some in there, into the bottle cap. I don't have to pour any out from the bottle or any of that good stuff. And this brush has already been used. I need to wash it after this use. 
So basically what I do is I just dab around my face and I dab I dab the most where I want to get um, more coverage. So basically like on my forehead, my T-zone. And then I like to get in between this the nose area right here. And the reason being is because that tends to get a little bit dark, at least for me. Maybe it's because I'm tan. I don't know what it is. But it gets a little dark. So I kind of want to lighten it up. So then I just basically um, blend in the foundation. And I could be using my flat top brush um, from Forever Female. Because this is also good to blend in foundation. So you can just use it like that. Lightly, do not press on it because you will mess up the bristles. But this will also blend in the foundation really well into your skin. And you can use this kind of brush or a flat top, um, whatever works best for you. I sometimes just use a mixture of both. I also use this um, for bronzer and for highlight. So I just go in a circular motion around my face until I see that it's pretty much all blended in. Now, right here on your jawline, you kind of want to blend that part in the most. Because what some ladies do is that they'll go ahead and put foundation over their cheeks, but they won't blend down. And you need to blend down because if not, you're going to have um, two color facial, you know, a two color tone, and you don't want that. You want to have an even tone. So I always blend down. My hair is getting in the way here. And if you want to go ahead and um, conceal your lips just to kind of, um, you know, give it that nude look, you can put a little bit of uh, foundation on your lips. It will not dry out your lips. So there we go. Um, what you kind of want to do next is set your face with a translucent powder, and I'm going to be using, um, and I can find it here, the Oopsie Daisy from Physicians Formula, and it's a translucent botanical um, face powder, and I absolutely love this to go ahead and just set my face. So I'm just taking this round uh, powder brush from MAC. And I wish I would have bought more of these in the Dollar Tree when I saw it, um, like maybe four months back. My mirror is all dirty now. So basically, um, that's all you do to have a flawless uh, face, and that's all pretty much for the routine. Um, then you can go ahead and add your blush, your bronzers, whatever it is you're going to add, um, your highlight to your cheeks, and just do your eyes. But basically, as a face routine, that is pretty much it. I will be uploading a video um, later on this afternoon or maybe tonight as to um, my face regime and what is it that I use to uh, remove my makeup and just exfoliate and wash my skin properly because that also, I think, is very important. So thank you girls for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day. Don't forget to uh, rate, comment, and subscribe below and check out my other videos. Bye, guys.